It looks like I lost the job here. You lost your vagina here? I only see the javelin. I love the vagina. The javelin. Yeah. Yeah, I, I lost my vajazzle in El Segundo. I think that sounds like a pretty good tweet to me. What do we reckon? Put it to the vote. I mean, it's up to you. <laughs> lost you my vajazzle. I lost my vajazzle in El Segundo. Is that tweet worthy or not? Depends on your point of view. What? What? Is that a yeah? yeah? It's up to you, man. Nobody can say whether you should do it, whether you. Docking initiated. Docking denied. Landing gear down. Is it V E J A S S L E or V A? Vajazzle or Vajazzle? Landing complete. Or V Jazzle. V Jazzle? J V E E? V I. I don't know, V Jazzle sounds right. I lost my vajazzle in El Segundo. I'll go with that one. Gotta get in it, got, got to get in it. Nobody gets Nobody my humor on Twitter. Twitter. They're all, They're all fucking, fucking lame ass, ass motherfuckers. motherfuckers. You know, if anything, Krupp should, should just join, join Twitter, Twitter just to like all my tweets. tweets. Okay, so we got we got 41 minutes to kill on the uh, Javelin tour. So start your timers. Okay, Google, okay. Let's start a timer for 41 minutes. Oh, Joe Biden's, Biden's holding a major press, press conference. conference. Oh, snap. Yeah. 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 Gotta watch that. that. Gotta watch that. that. Oh, oh, Joe. Joe. We're going, no, no, really, I'm a progressive. No, honestly, I am. No, 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 really, I am. I'm, I'm not the author of the crime bill. No, 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 no. No, 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 don't tell, no, don't tell anyone. Fucking He's gonna have to do some major shit in order to keep Democrats in power. We don't want Trump part two. He's gonna have to do some major fucking work. He's gonna have to solve a lot of fucking problems. He's got his work cut out. 
I'm and going on the freaking bingo, dudes. We get Trump part two. Well, well back to back fucking to square, square one, one we go. We go. Amazingly won, won, to be honest. Amazingly won. But Trump was a bit of a fucking asshole, but... Even, even so. so. A lot of Americans are hard to fucking please. I mean, who'd, who'd vote for fucking Joe Biden? I mean, other than in a really desperate situation. I think that's why he won. Desperate situation calls for desperate measures. I guess so sometimes. Although I would have considered desperate measures and DNC taking responsibility for their shit to be good shit. Yeah, yeah. nice. Instead of harping on about I'm on a javelin. Dude, I'm on a javelin. Dude, you don't even know. Harping on about the fucking. Even fucking burning is harping on about two thousand dollar checks. It's like, well, I'm sorry, but no. Even I know, and I'm not even the country. It wasn't a two thousand dollar check. It was a one thousand four hundred dollar check. They don't fucking don't fucking bullshit us with this. What the fuck are you doing? You really fucking push it? Just say fourteen hundred. You know, be honest instead of fucking lying through your teeth. Fucking annoys the shit out of me. Dude, I'm on a super big ship, and this ship is awesome. Like, oh my god, it's just right off the gate. As soon as you step off the the docking ring, it looks like crawler. It honestly looks like crawler. U E E S Warham. As part of this year's Invictus celebrations, I'd like to invite you to take a look around and get an up close look at an active military vessel. Some of the actual crew members have graciously volunteered their time to explain what life is like aboard the ship. I would like to remind you that the entire ship is not available for exploration, so please be respectful of unauthorized areas. Thank you, and enjoy your visit. Well, this sucks. Yeah, that was cool. Let's go inside. Oh, yeah, this one is closed. Oh, look at this. This is the crew quarters. This is so cool. There's so many crew quarters. Oh, it's the mess hall. Hello. They got an arcade in here. Frickin' right. Oh. Is somebody calling me over? Look at this, dude. This is so cool. Look at this. This is so cool. Like, this is a spaceship in a game, and it's like realistically a spaceship in a game. Like, you could see this, you know, being in a sci fi show and being like, I believe that's a real spaceship. To an extent. You know? Like, a really, like, a really. really DK on the uh, session front. Can't face ED. Don't know how to dock in ED. You know, I play a lot and I do know how to dock in ED. It's just, it's a real pain in the ass. This channel was last destroyed. It was originally built by Aegis Dynamics. And has been. I don't think it's doing that. 
launching under the command of Captain Omar Singh, the ship initially served as a vessel in a sense of a demographic. A posting that put it close to the Vandal front. The Warhammer saw action. I don't think you have a graphic is the right word. We were protected protruding civilian and naval forces when the system ultimately fell, earning a ribbon for valor in the process. For the next several decades, the Warhammer transitioned between fleets in a variety of support and patrol positions, even participating in the UEE push to reclaim the Nexus system in the 2930s. Most recently, the Warhammer distinguished itself as the primary combat vessel to repel the outlaw group known as Xenothrite from the Stanton system. Since then, the Warhammer has been placed in dry dock for repairs, but is heading back to active service once this year's Invictus festivities are concluded. The room you're currently seated in is the main briefing room for the entire ship. Based around a hollow volume built by Microtech, the crew gathers here to discuss everything from battle strategies to repair schedules. The marine detail assigned to the ship also uses this room to plan out their boarding actions or outline combat strategies. This room is even acted as a venue for off-duty activities, such as vid screens or sporting event parties. We hope that you'll take the opportunity to explore the ship and get an up-close look at one of the vanguards aboard. On behalf of Captain Medcat and the rest of the crew, I want to wish you a fantastic Invictus. I hope we see you next year. Transition between fleets in a variety of support and patrol positions, even participating in the UEE push to reclaim the Nexus system in the Based around a hollow volume, everything from battle strategies to repair schedules. The marine detail assigned to the ship also uses this room to plan out their boarding actions or outline combat strategies. Don't mind me, I'm just taking some screenshots. Oh, I need to go to bed now. Good night, Chris. Good night, Chris. Good night. Good night. Justice! Ruthless rap assassins! This javelin class before was originally built by Aegis Dynamic. Well, at least Glitch liked it. There you go. He retweeted it. He retweeted that lost my bejazzle with El Segundo. <laughs> Why not? Good old bitch. Justice. 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 So a lot of the ship is off limits. 
uh, unfortunately, for better or worse, but there's some really cool stuff going on here, and I'm really glad that they showed us what they showed us here. Um, I'm trying to figure out how to get the heck out of here again. Justice. 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 I love crew quarters, and look at these crew quarters, like, there's books. Hi folks, welcome to the Warhammer. I am leading Starman Detma, and this, as you probably guessed, is one of the two barracks on the ship. And I know, I know, you must be thrilled to see where Navy personnel sleep, and let me be the first to tell you, it's every bit as exciting as promised. Javelins are... Pretty great when it comes to sleeping arrangements, as they have enough bunks for the full crew. Which is amazing because it avoids situations known as hot bunking, where you swap out bunks with somebody on the opposite ship, and that is horrible. Uh, this one time on my old ship, I had to share with this guy who had just the worst smelling socks. Um, and I'm talking, you know, the military could have weaponized it. Kind of and I had to try and fall asleep with that every day. So, uh, yeah, after that, these bunks are a, a Oh, dream. dude, there's a door behind this guy. <laughs> and I'm just thinking that, uh, actually, I don't think my CEO would like me talking about how bad hot bunking is. So, maybe just forget I said anything. Uh, anyway, uh, each one has special slots for I'm upset that I don't have a mind. It's capable of sealing you up to give you a little Somebody bit of it from me. You're always moving around the barracks. <laughs> Sleeping schedules shift slightly too, so they can activate the full crew. Ruthless Rock Assassins were amazing. Heavy combat, you know. So you, you're kind of always sleeping with one eye open. I mean, we get short sleep schedules if we are patrolling dangerous space, so... I mean, you already grab your sleep when you can. Sorry, I am rambling. Uh, otherwise, yeah, I'm not sure what to tell you. This is where we sleep. Not a whole lot of mystery to it. But I hope this has been enlightening. Please have a look around if you like, but don't touch anything in the bunks, as this is an active ship, and everything in here is the property of the crew. So, be cool. Proper UK track, and it wasn't a dream. It was oh, a dude, nightmare. We found the bathrooms. We found the bathrooms. And the show. Amazing. Is. The lyrics are fucking amazing. This is really well designed uh, bathrooms. I mean, they're uh, obviously not functional yet in terms of like the functionality that is available on other ships, which is not very functional either. But you know, uh. Alright, right. let's settle let's down. down. My name's My name Lieutenant Kamala. Are they really in the head pissing and shitting to the game? Hammer. That means I'm in charge of coordinating fire well, between our various gunners during the stream and find out what I'm doing. In order to maximize you know? combat, combat effectiveness. effectiveness. But, but when we aren't in combat. combat I strive, I strive to keep my team sharp, sharp by running, running through engagement engage drills and simulated encounters. encounters. Now, the Javelin comes standard with 15 turrets, 13 of which have embedded operators. There are six turrets, like the one you see here, that run along the side of the ship, each of which is equipped with a pair of size 7 cannons for larger targets, 
and a pair of size 4 Gatlings for smaller targets like fighters and even incoming missiles. It's really civilized way. We've got four more turrets on the bow of the ship, armed with size 7 energy cannons and three gunners on the underside with the same. All this firepower is coupled with a heavy payload it's to make how. the Warhammer a real problem for all sizes of ship. The officer, bro. During the Xeno threat, the our gunners were under the destruction of over 70 hostile elements and he was the man. Ships, as well as We've safety this turret to get to the It was wasn't a dream, it's an amazing tune. Amazing, amazing derivative. But I'll remind you this is an active military vessel. Be respectful all the same. Thank you. And documents, literally documents. documents. Uh, the African uh, influx or the Caribbean influx into the UK at the 1960s, 50s, but in the 90s. Great too. Great too. I think I have, I have enough loot in Destiny 2 to actually catch up now. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, I've yeah, been doing, doing nothing, nothing but collecting, collecting the loot for the game for a few months. Because I can't actually play with, with what I had before. I mean, that's kind of Destiny 2, is you just can't play with what you have. You have to get the better loot all the time. Yeah, the yeah, meta yeah, loot. The expansion pack. Oh, yeah, that's even worse. Well, I mean, if you want to play Destiny 2, that's what it comes with, bro. That's all there is to it. That was an awesome tour of the Aegis Javelin. Sensei was a little bit wild during that, but that's okay. I mean, it's Friday night, you gotta rock out, you know? <laughs> <laughs> 